Hi there, Al with Summit Racing Equipment and On All Cylinders. We're here at Super Summit 2016 and I have Rob with Carbonite Metal Coatings here with me. And Rob, you have a pretty unique car. Tell me a little bit about what you have here behind us. Okay, what you're looking at here is a Bonneville Streamliner. We built this car to be the first wheel-driven car to 500 miles an hour. Th now, that's a pretty difficult feat. What, what are some of the things that you have to overcome to to make a car go 500 miles an hour? Mostly it's aerodynamics. It's like running through a shallow end of a swimming pool. You can only run so fast. You have to figure out a way to get through that swimming pool easier. So there's, there's a lot of experience that comes with designing a car like this. What, what, what has led you to, to coming up with this great idea? We actually had a lot of help from other sources. Uh, we started posting some stuff on the internet, how we were going to do it in a forum. And we had a gentleman named Eric Alstrom that happened to be an aircraft designer come on board and says, oh, what you got there is a brick. Well, let me help you. <laughs> and he helped us a lot. Now, what about your background? How, how, did, you, how did you get involved in, in this? What, what led you to saying, you know what, I want to go 500 miles an hour? Uh, really, uh, maybe mental disease, I'm not sure. It was, I went out to Bonneville a couple times and got salt fever. Okay. And I was so excited about it. I was like, we got to do this. And, and we started initially, we were just going to build a car to go 400 miles an hour and be one of the few cars over 400 miles an hour. And we met Eric, he says, well, how about for the same amount of money and the same amount of horsepower you have, we go 500 miles an hour. And I'm like, mm, yeah, I like that idea. Now, speaking of horsepower, what, what kind of, what is your power plant behind this? It's a 2600 horsepower big block Chevy uh, with a dart block and um, BMF cylinder heads. Pretty much a conventional big block Chevy. Uh, we're making like 30 pounds of boost, uh, 7200 RPMs, and it'll, it'll make you know, approximately you know, 2618 horsepower at, that, at those levels. Now, you've been involved in, in the automotive world for a while. Now, what are some other things that you've done in your past with the automotive industry? Okay, uh, we're in sprint cars for a while, we tried that. Um, we also did uh, the flashlight drags over there, and it were, it's like sort of a uh, outlaw street racing thing. Uh, and then also just drag racing and SCTA racing, or SCCA racing, uh, run a closed course racing. So a few, a few things. So you, you've, been, you've just been racing for, for decades, decades. Now, tell me a little bit about Carbonite. What, it, what is that and what, it, how, did, how does that get involved with, with land speed racing? Uh, Carbonite's our company that sponsors us. Um, I, I founded Carbonite approximately eight, 19 years ago. Uh, we just apply texture carbide coating on different tooling for grip. So it's a lot of the car guys that uh, have tubing benders, um, header manufacturers, all those things that you're trying to get a grip on the tube so you don't slip in a die, but don't you, if you can't keep clamping it that hard because it'll crush it. So that's where our coding comes into play. That's, you know, you, in all facets, you're, you're involved. And you're also trying to give back to the, to the younger generation and, and get them more involved. What, what are you trying to do with the kids nowadays? We go into high schools and we visit high schools and we uh, do a 25 minute PowerPoint presentation to the physics, the physics class kids and also the shop class kids. And then after the 25 minute PowerPoint presentation on how we built the car, how we built the team, and a little bit about what it takes to make this happen, we let the kids go out and sit in a car and get their picture taken and stuff sitting in a car. So, Just really trying to reach out to that younger generation and, and, and get them involved and, and that's always great. I, I like to see how you know the, the older generations reaching out to the younger generation and, and saying hey you know we like to have fun and we like to go fast and or we like to go around in circles and I, I really appreciate you Rob one, taking the time and talking to us for a little bit and telling us about your, your car and, and your goals. And two, giving back to the younger generation. I, thank you so much for coming out to Super Summit 2016. My pleasure. Thank you. Yep.